ECU Athletics and U.S. Cellular present The Jeff Lebo Show. The Jeff Lebo Show is brought to you by U.S. Cellular, the official wireless sponsor of the ECU Pirates. And now, the voice of the Pirates, Jeff Charles. Welcome to the Jeff Lebo Show. It's our first show of the year, and we welcome Coach Lebo back with our weekly visits coming up on the show. Our Brian Bailey will have our Pirate player profile, and B.J. Tyson will be in the spotlight. Really excited about the sophomore season for B.J. coming up. Also, Coach Connors will be here, another installment of Coach Connors, and Giannis Bowden will be in the spotlight with some off-season conditioning news. And the Pirates will head out on the road to take on the College of Charleston in Charleston, South Carolina on Monday night. Coach Lebo joins me right after this. The Jeff Lebo Show is brought to you by U.S. Cellular. With 4G LTE from U.S. Cellular, you can post, text, and stream from the middle of anywhere. There are many sides to basketball star and fashion icon Russell Westbrook. And with coverage in the middle of anywhere from U.S. Cellular, he can find some new ones. Like farm. Brussels, Brussels. Brussels speaking. Paleontologist. Hashtag T-Rex. Park Ranger. Where am I? And TV spokesperson. That's my life. I got it. With you Cellular, Cellular, you can do all the things you like. From the, the middle, middle of anywhere. That is my line. You've built wealth by traveling your own path. Investing in the strength of your ideas. Capitalizing on the best in you. At bb and Wealth, we understand your passion for what you do and your vision for what you'll do next. That's why our experienced advisors create the financial plan that works at every step of your journey sharing more than 140 years of knowledge to give you the power to make the best decisions and to continue sharing knowledge of your own. bb and Wealth, sharing knowledge for a brighter direction. People ship all kinds of things. But what if that thing is a few hundred thousand doses of flu vaccine? That need to be kept at 41 degrees. While being shipped to a country where it's 90 degrees. In the shade. Sound hard? Yeah. Does that mean people in Laos shouldn't get their vaccine? We didn't think so. From figuring it out to getting it done. We're here to help. If you could download 25 songs in one second, you'd listen to more new music. If you could download a TV episode in two seconds, you'd watch more hit shows. If you could download an HD feature film in just 42 seconds, you'd see more great movies. And if you had powerful one gig speed from Suddenlink, you'd be more connected than anyone. Announcing one gig internet only from Suddenlink. More power to you. How do you measure the value of a college education? What are the values that give it worth? The rigorous pursuit of knowledge, the drive to innovate, the commitment to improving communities, and the courage to stand up and lead the way into a brighter tomorrow. These are the values of an East Carolina education. Come discover their true worth for yourself. East Carolina University. Tomorrow starts here. The Jeff Lebo Show continues with sponsorship by BB&T, sharing knowledge for a brighter direction, member FDIC, and by your local nationwide insurance agents. Coach joins us now, and Jeff, this is your sixth year at ECU. Big picture talk here now. Where do you think your program is? Well, I think, you know, we've had a lot of changes to our program, and uh, that's exciting. We've got a new practice facility. I think our program is really growing, and uh, obviously a new league, too. Um, we've had a lot of changes, and the jump to the American is very exciting for us, and playing against, I think, uh, high-quality teams right now, three that are in the top 25 right now. So quite a jump for us, and um, that forces us to really raise the expectations for our program. Going back to last spring, there were a couple of guys not with your ball club who you thought would probably be with you, right? Well, we had two, really, that were starters. Uh, Marshall Gilmet, uh, 
who um, we had to uh, take the uh, medical uh, hardship rule with, and he won't be able to play with us. Really, is really sad for Marshall. And then Terry Wisnett, also a guy that uh, uh, would have been a fifth-year senior for us, Jeff, a double-figure guy as a transfer from Florida State that uh, we were having high expectations for a senior season. So we'll have other guys that will have to step up and fill those shoes. So, Coach, going into this weekend, four and three for your ball club. Uh, how do you feel about the start? Well, I think we did some. We've done some good things. We had a long trip out to the West Coast where we really challenged ourselves against high-level people. California was top 14 in the country. San Diego State, uh, the last five years, has had two Sweet 16 teams. So uh, I think we we got better. We found uh, finally found BJ's offense a little bit, and that's really helped us. FAU coming in here this week, uh, a ball club from the Conference USA days. Uh, you had some familiarity with these guys. Well, we did, and we played them uh, last year, and they really thumped us pretty good down there, so our guys were really excited to play. I was worried about how they would react after a long uh, West Coast uh, swing, but we played really well with a lot of energy and enthusiasm. No doubt about that. Let's now roll those highlights. Pirates get off to a great start, and Coach Boy, it's good to see B.J. Tyson back in the flow. Well, he's really played well offensively the last three games. Struggled out of the gate, but uh, really he's playing with some confidence right now. Caleb White hits a three-pointer for you, Coach, and uh, boy, it's important for him to knock down that shot. Well, it is, and uh, you know he's the one guy on our team that I really have a lot of confidence in, over 40% from three. Lance Tejada also comes in off the bench and gets a basket here. Yeah, really got to get Lance going offensively. He's really been struggling shooting the basketball. He's playing much better, but uh, I'd like to see him get four for seven here in a game and get his confidence going. Pirates get off to a great start, leading 14 to three, and Kentrell Barkley really brings energy, doesn't he? Well, lot, nice to bring KB off the bench. Uh, he brings uh, energy, enthusiasm, and some scoring punch for us, and uh, I love his length on the offensive glass. And then, Coach, how about Grant Bryant? He gets in the game and gets a couple of quick hoops here. Well, he can take the ball to the basket. He's really strong driving the ball to the basket. He's a kid that's really worked hard. It hasn't played a lot, but uh, really love his energy. Yeah, Grant gets another jumper here, and the Pirates are up 23-6. to six. Coach, how is it playing with a lead like that? Well, it's it's nice, and uh, really the third game in a row, uh, we've held somebody under 20 points in the first half. Mike Zangary gets a jumper here, and Mike just plays extremely hard. Well, he's been playing uh, much better offensively. If we just, uh, my big thing with Mike is just being able to rebound and be physical. B.J. Tyson gets a layup here. The Pirates are up 32 to 14. At halftime, uh, Coach, how difficult, though, is it to play with a lead like that? Well, I, I, I challenged our team in the second half as we start out here. You'll see a lot of layups. Uh, we really didn't want them to trick us into shooting early three-point shots. We took it right to the rim with no shot blocker in there, and we extend the lead here early in the second half. Well, you're right with the layups. B.J. Tyson gets one. Prince Williams uh, gets a couple. How about Prince's play? Well, he took the ball to the basket nice in this game, and uh, I thought uh, you know his decision-making was much better. He's cut down on his turnovers here early in the season. Kanu Aja comes in off the bench. He gets a layup, too. Well, he's physical, gets an offensive rebound, uh, gets a, a stick-back layup for us. That's what he does for us. One for the highlight tape here as B.J. Tyson uh, gets the dunk down the baseline. They went to the zone. We went to the lob play for B.J., which we've run in the past, and a great pass and a great finish in traffic. Caleb White gets a three-pointer here. The Pirates are up 66-38. to 38. And then Clarence Williams uh, giving you some good play, too, Coach. Well, Clarence has uh, started with Ziggy being out, and he's really good in the zone in the high post area. He made a great pass, and there he is making the, the little elbow jump shot. Then how about your walk-on? We know he can shoot it. He gets in the game and knocks one down here. Well, they ran the play for him. Uh, they know he can shoot it, and they want him uh, They want him to get the shot. Our, the, the team does, and uh, he can really bang it, Drew Bost, uh, from deep. Drew Bost gets the basket late. The fans go wild, and the Pirates win it 74-48. to well, Obviously, Ziggy didn't play, so it was a good opportunity for me to, um, you know, just prove myself on the floor and earn Coach Debo's trust, show that I can play defense, you know, score the ball, execute. Um, you know, it was a good team win, too, overall, so. It feel great, um, but I just want to get credit to uh, Coach Lebo and Coach Nettie for um, staying with me throughout the whole thing. You know, um, the first couple of games was rough. Um, seeing it not go in, you know, small hole, but now it's starting to get bigger. I um, worked on my shot every day before practice and after practice, so it's starting to come along. We'll be right back with more on the Jeff Lebo Show, sponsored by Suddenlink. One gig speed from Suddenlink is here. 
Stream, share, and game like never before. Sudden Link, more power to you. Bad news, have to bring the car in to get the brakes fixed. Taking care of your car shouldn't take over your life. Meineke is your one-stop shop. Right now, get 50% off brake pads and shoes. Meineke, on with life. Memorial Hospital. We take health care personally. When it comes to you, we sweat the stuff. Because while you're not our only patient, we think there's no reason it can't feel that way. When you need us, we're here. And you can expect extraordinary care from physicians and nurses who are committed to our community. And to you. Because we know you. We're your friends. We're your neighbors. And we're your hospital. Bad news, have to bring the car in to get the brakes fixed. Taking care of your car shouldn't take over your life. Meineke is your one-stop shop. Right now, get 50% off brake pads and shoes. Meineke, on with life. If you could download 25 songs in one second, you'd listen to more new music. If you could download a TV episode in two seconds, you'd watch more hit shows. If you could download an HD feature film in just 42 seconds, you'd see more great movies. And if you had powerful one gig speed from Sunlink, you'd be more connected than anyone. Announcing one gig internet only from Sunlink. More power to you. Our core values form the foundation of the American. They guide our actions on and off the court. Brotherhood. Intensity. Effort, accountability, resilience, relentlessness. Our core values are constant and shape our identity. Passion, character, focus, commitment, togetherness. We are the American Athletic Conference. How do you measure the value of a college education? What are the values that give it worth? The rigorous pursuit of knowledge, the drive to innovate, the commitment to improving communities, and the courage to stand up and lead the way into a brighter tomorrow. These are the values of an East Carolina education. Come discover their true worth for yourself. East Carolina University. Tomorrow starts here. Today's highlights are presented by Lenore Memorial Hospital. It's my hospital. Welcome back to the show. The Pirates hosted USC Upstate on a Friday night. It was the return of Eddie Payne, and longtime Pirate basketball fans will remember Coach Payne back in 1993. He took ECU to its last NCAA tournament. And, Jeff, I know that you've known Eddie for a long time. I have, and he's a great guy. He's done a great job with this Upstate program, transitioning him uh, to Division One. They've had some great seasons. He's a terrific guy and a, and a, and a great coach. And uh, he's got a young group this year. Uh, they've had some ups and downs, but uh, consistently you talk about a guy that knows how to coach the game of basketball. He's really good for kids. That's Eddie Payne. We welcome Denny back to Williams Arena, Minji's Coliseum, for the game as the Pirates took on USC Upstate. East Carolina gets the basketball, and Coach, you run this play on the baseline again and a dunk by B.J. Tyson. Yeah, we ran a couple of lobs for, for B.J. to try to loosen up the back line of, uh, of their zone, and uh, he can go get it when you put it up near the rim. No doubt about that. He gets a layup here. Pirates go up 10-5, to five, getting a really, really good start, and then Aja gets a dunk here. A yeah, nice little bounce pass, good finish there for Canoe around the rim. And then uh, they have a couple of really good freshman guards, Coach, and Holmes comes down here and knocks down a three, and they knocked down some threes, didn't they? Well, they went 13 of 27, and typically you lose games when another team shoots 13 of 27 from three. Give them credit. I thought they really played well. Dunk by B.J. Tyson here. Pirates go up 18 to 15. Then Prince Williams knocks down a three, a 21-18 lead. How about Prince's play? 
I think Prince 4 of 7, 4 0, assist to turnover. I thought he was really solid for the whole game. Mike Zangari had to match up with the big guy they had inside, who's 6'11, 260, and Mike gets a jumper to go here. Yeah, it was nice to see Mike get that. That guy was big in there, 6'11, 260, and he could score a little bit if you played behind. And then Cunningham gets a basket here. This was the circus shot right before halftime. You can see it goes high off the glass, and it goes in 39 33. Pirates lead at halftime. We pick up action now in the second half, and you get Caleb White going here, Coach. Well, got him going here early in the second half, back-to-back -back three-point shots. Uh, we did a lot of ball screening. We really were trying to pass up all other perimeter shots by everybody else except for uh, Caleb. He knocks two in a row there. B.J. Tyson gets a basket here. Pirates go up 10, and then Schulte comes in and gets a basket off the bench for Upstate. Cuts the lead to three points here. You know, we, we had a nice run to start, and then they had a nice run coming back, and, and then we go on another run here coming up, and we just couldn't get enough stops. They'd make a three. Uh, and we come down and score, they make another three. We couldn't quite get away from them. And then, Coach, three consecutive baskets here by Kentrell Barkley. He gets a layup, he gets a dunk, he gets a jumper to go, and, boy, he was good. Uh, he was good out in transition. And, you know, I have a lot of confidence in KB for a freshman to, to step in in those kind of games and uh, know what I'm going to get. Yeah, the Pirates win the game 82-71, missing, uh, making some free throws late. And then, Coach, you had uh, Coach Eddie Payne after the game had a chance to visit with the former head coach of the Pirates who led ECU to the 1993 NCAA tournament. You got the old ball out of the trophy case and got Eddie to sign it. Well, it was, it was a nice moment. I, I, I really enjoyed it. And I dug that ball out, Jeff, uh, of the old scales building. And when we had the trophy cases, I couldn't find anything to, to put in there. And I'm glad I dug it out and uh, found it in, in an old drawer over there in scales and got a chance for, it to, for him to sign that thing. Well, well, that was a great gesture on your part, and Eddie said it was an honor to sign it. Pirates win the game over USC Upstate. At Golden Corral, your hard-earned dollar goes a lot further. Guaranteed by Article 5. Get more for less. Introducing the take home box, a whole nother meal, just $1.99. Have your fill at the Endless Buffet, then fill up your take home box for just $1.99 more. Because today's take home box is tomorrow's snack box, lunch box, you decide. This meal's got wheels, baby. Woo! Golden Corral, the best buffet in the USA. Building wealth is an ongoing journey. Every step you take should lead in the right direction. At BB&T Wealth, we've spent more than 140 years sharing knowledge and helping clients plan, getting to know you as well as we know your life goals. With the strength of our experience on your side, you have the confidence to make the best financial decisions from one generation to the next, because the rewards of managing wealth wisely should always be close. BB&T Wealth, sharing knowledge for a brighter direction. Tired of hearing no? We, we say, say yes. yes. DriveHereNow.com is the source for your next ride. Four locations, over 250 vehicles. We got a ride for you. Greenville Motor Company. Memorial Drive. East Carolina Auto Exchange. Charles Boulevard. Washington Motor Company. Carolina Avenue. Kinston Auto Mart. Vernon Avenue. Cars, trucks, SUVs, motorcycles. We, we got them. Good, bad, slow, no credit. You're, you're approved. approved. Credit union financing to buy here, pay here. We, we do, do it all. all. Call 252-756-5100 to get riding now. Or online at DriveHereNow.com. There are many sides to basketball star and fashion icon Russell Westbrook. And with coverage in the middle of anywhere from U.S. Cellular, he can find some new ones. Like farm. Brussels, Brussels. Brussels speaking. Paleontologist. Hashtag T-Rex. Park Ranger. Where am I? And TV spokesperson. That's my life. I got it. With U.S. Cellular, you can do all the things you like. From the middle of anywhere. That is my line. How do you measure the value of a college education? What are the values that give it worth? The rigorous pursuit of knowledge, the drive to innovate, the commitment to improving communities, and the courage to stand up and lead the way into a brighter tomorrow. These are the values of an East Carolina education. Come discover their true worth for yourself. East Carolina University. Tomorrow starts here. We are competitors. We are teammates. We are rivals. We are friends. We are fans. We are scholars. We are leaders. 
We are champions. We are believers. We are all Americans. We are more than what you might realize. We are the American Athletic Conference. Last year, B.J. Tyson really burst onto the scene. He was a first-team All-American Conference selection. This year, he's a marked man, so a little different situation for B.J. Our Brian Bailey had a chance to take an up-close and personal look. This week's Pirate Profile is brought to you by Quality Collision. More than a name, a commitment. Our Pirate Profile this week is with East Carolina guard B.J. Tyson. Got off to a little bit of a slow start, but you've got it going now, don't you? Yeah, I have. Um, I just give credit to Coach uh, Lee Bo and Coach Netty for sticking with me through everything, um, preparation and everything with that. So I enjoy it. You were obviously a fan favorite. Take us through one of those plays where you come off a screen, ball goes way up in the air, you go flying through the air, grab the ball, slam it home, and the crowd goes nuts. Well, you know, we um, – we practice it a lot, um, and sometimes we'd be in the huddles, and coach would be like, "All right, we're gonna um, call X, which is the alley play." And when he does, when he say that, I look at the guard, whoever's gonna throw it, and be like, "Just throw it up, there and I'm gonna go get it." When you look at this Pirate basketball team, how good can they be this year? Oh man, we're gonna be great. Um, we just gotta um, come together as a team and find wins on the road. I know um, at home we're going to be a lot better than we was last year. I know uh, last year we went like 7-1. and one. This year we're going to try to go undefeated. So that's our Pirate Profile this week, B.J. Tyson. Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, today we're with Giannis Bowden. Number 46, uh, today what we're going to do is we're going to look at some hamstring strengthening activity. A first exercise we're going to do today is what's referred to uh, in our profession, particularly here at East Carolina, is a poor man's glute ham. So essentially what we're going to do is, is isolate the hamstrings and glutes. I'm going to hold him down. He's going to move forward and try to keep his hips in the proper position and then catch himself Walk it back, nice and tall with the hips, nice and slow on the way down until he has to catch himself one more time. Good. The next thing we want to do uh, is we want to train the hamstrings in an elongated position uh, in a reactive manner that's more specific to running. And essentially, we want to develop the hamstrings up high as it ties in with the glutes. Go. Good. I think it's evident uh, as you watch Giannis Bound that he's got a very high level of explosive power. He's got a great future with us. Got three years left. Got a tremendous frame right now, weighing about 225, 230. We're hoping to get him up to about 245, 250 in the future. And we know that he's going to perform well. Camp Connors is brought to you by these local nationwide insurance agents. In the nation, if you celebrate it, Nationwide protects it. We put members first. Join the nation. Nationwide is on your side. To join the nation, call your local Nationwide agent, Tommy Davis in Windsor, or David Walker in Greenville. Eye Care Center, Eastern North Carolina's premier optometric specialists have become one of the few in the nation to offer patients the most technologically advanced lenses on the market, enabling the personalization of progressive and single vision lenses with our exclusive digital surfacing process that delivers high performance lenses with the most precision in their optical lab in Greenville. Call today to make your appointment for the most precise, accurate lenses on the market. Visit us in Washington, Williamson, Plymouth, and three locations in Greenville, 252-756-4204.
We are competitors. We are teammates. We are rivals. We are friends. We are fans. We are scholars. We are leaders. We are champions. We are believers. We are all Americans. We are more than what you might realize. We are the American Athletic Conference. How do you measure the value of a college education? What are the values that give it worth? The rigorous pursuit of knowledge, the drive to innovate, the commitment to improving communities, and the courage to stand up and lead the way into a brighter tomorrow. These are the values of an East Carolina education. Come discover their true worth for yourself. East Carolina University. Tomorrow starts here. This week's Look Ahead is brought to you by the Eye Care Center, eye doctors focused on you, and the official eye care provider of the Pirates. Welcome back to the show. The Pirates head out on the road again on Monday night to take on the College of Charleston. That's Earl Grant's ball club. He's trying to rebuild them, isn't he? Well, Earl, I've known for a long time. He used to work my camps. That's how old I'm getting right now. <laughs> but uh, he's from Charleston. He's taken over a program that uh, has got a lot of history, a lot of tradition, and is coming off a big win at home against LSU. And another game on the road. Uh, they usually have great crowds down there. As you mentioned, a great tradition, Jeff. Great tradition, uh, great history, and uh, a good challenge for us again another road game true road game our third early in the season not too many in our conference have had three true road games this early our thanks to coach Lebo for being on the show our thanks to you as well we're here each week with our report on East Carolina Pirate basketball have a great week Eastern North Carolina the Jeff Lebo show has been presented by US Cellular the official wireless sponsor of the ECU Pirates the Jeff Lebo Show is an exclusive presentation of IMG, America's home for college sports.